The average grocery shop on a bulk could set you back $400 to $500 every month, and that's a lot. But what if I told you you could break this down by 80%? You see, this brings your cost per meal to a dollar per meal simply by choosing the right food. I mean, why should you listen to me in the first place? Mainly because I've lived this. I went from 77 kg down to 107 kg. So, in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how I was able to bulk but cheap. Let's go. But hey, before we get started, there are two rules. Rule number one, every single meal I'm gonna show you in this video will cost a dollar to make. Rule number two, every single meal would have at least 50 grams of protein in them. To make sure you follow along throughout the video, here's a screenshot of my Lee Bulking ebook that tells you exactly how much protein, carbs, fat, and calories you should eat on a daily basis to let you get to your goal. And of course, if you want the full copy of the Lean Bulking ebook, the link's in my bio, so let's get crazy. So we're gonna split this up into breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And I got options for each of these and a little protein snack at the end for you too. By the end of this video, you would know why I think the best protein source is to get your value for money and overall protein. And of course, the vegans are welcome here too. Just to watch, of course. So let's get into it. For the breakfast option one, we need the following ingredients, eggs, sardines, and bread. Based off my portion size, we need three eggs, one sardine, six slices of bread, and the total protein for this meal is 52 grams of protein, coming to a total of $1.73. This is the second most expensive meal from this list. Next is the second option for breakfast. We need the following ingredients, peanut butter, oats, eggs and sardines and for my portion size we need two tablespoons of peanut butter two cups of oats two eggs and one sardine the total protein for this meal is 52 grams of protein and the total cost for this meal comes down to a dollar and 98 cents and this is hands down the most expensive meal on this list everything is a lot cheaper than this so now the options for lunch this meal is as simple as it gets you need chicken drumsticks, rice, spinach, and that's optional. For my portion size, we need two chicken drumsticks of around nine to 10 pounds and rice around 220 grams, which is around 0.5 pounds. This brings the total protein for this meal to 65 grams of protein and a total cost of a dollar and 20 cents. And for the second option for lunch, we need nine to 10 pounds of chicken thighs and around four ounces of pasta, which is around 112 grams of pasta. And this brings the total protein to 59 grams for this meal and the total cost of a dollar and two cents. And you can add a pasta sauce if you want, but that's optional. Now onto dinner. And for dinner, we will need the following ingredients. Pinto beans, chicken drumsticks. For my portion size of pinto beans, we will need around two ounces and again, two drumsticks for around nine to 10 pounds. This brings the total protein to 60 grams and a total cost of 94 cents. For the second option for dinner, we need chicken drumsticks and pasta. I'm having around two ounces of pasta. And I'm gonna have this again with two drumsticks of around nine to 10 pounds. And the total cost for this meal is 92 cents and has a total of 57 grams of protein. Again, pasta sauce is optional. And of course, like I promised, a cheap protein snack. Just so if you wanted to have something quick, something on the go, if you're not feeling like having a meal, this will like to hit your protein goals and stays cheap, of course. You need two scoops of the protein supplement casein. For everyone that doesn't know this already, I always recommend casein compared to whey just because casein is slow digesting protein. So what basically happens is your body supplies a lot of protein for a lot longer. Like I said, two scoops of the protein supplement casein, a cup of milk and a tablespoon of peanut butter. This brings the total cost to a dollar and 34 cents. And the total protein for this meal is 61 grams of protein. Throughout this video, 
I have highlighted a lot of good protein sources. However, if I can only have one to be the most cost efficient and provide me with the best amount of protein within my budget, it will have to be chicken drumsticks. The price of this for the amount of protein it gives you is great value for money, quite honestly. I have put a list of all the ingredients here. If you need this for your next grocery shopping list, you can pause the video now, write this down or take a screenshot. But yeah, I hope this video was helpful for anyone that is struggling to bulk and trying to bring the cost down. If you enjoyed this, drop a like. Let's get this to a thousand likes. And yeah, that'll be all for now. And I'll see you when I see you.